Hi guys, my name is Brynn, and if you're new to my channel, you should totally hit that big red subscribe button down below, but if you're not, welcome back to my channel. I'm actually really excited for today's video because I feel like it's bringing back like kind of like the old YouTube. Today's video is my shoe collection. I love shoes. <laughs> shoes are really cool. This is literally just every single pair of shoes that I own. Let's just get started. <laughs> my first pair of shoes are boring. They're just a pair of black Vans and they're kind of gross looking. These have been through absolutely everything. Literally everything. And they were actually for my brother. He grew out of them and I liked them so I kept them. I had actually had taken these shoes on a trip a million years ago with some of my friends that I had a while ago. We went to the mountains. I took these shoes and went swimming with them because we couldn't go swimming without shoes. So I took these and we went swimming in the lake. It was like one of the best trips I ever went on. And it's kind of sad I'm not really friends with any of the people anymore. If you're watching this, let's hang out. Now these are like my work shoes because I don't really have any other shoes that really fit the dress code. Long story short about those shoes, they're just my work shoes. <laughs> my next pair of shoes are just these flip-flops. They're from American Eagle. I've had these shoes since 2015, I think, and it's 2019 now. So I've had these shoes for a really long time. If you look at the bottoms, like they're so worn out, like I'm missing parts of the shoe at the top and the bottom. And they're just my go-to pair of flip-flops. I love them. Pair of shoes are one of my favorite pairs that I own. I literally love them. They are knock-off Birkenstocks. They're from Kohl's and they look like this. They're so cute. They're by the brand Sonoma. I love these. These are like my go-to pair and they're just so comfortable. One day I'll invest in a pair of Birkenstocks. Now when I say that my next pair have been through everything, they have literally been through everything. I've had these shoes since sixth grade. I needed to buy them for a lip sync dance I did with my friends back in sixth grade. I still have them. They still fit, but they're just my plain white high tops. Converse. They're not even white anymore. There's grass stains on them. They're so dirty. I don't know if you guys can see, but there's like dirt even up here. Need to definitely invest in a new pair. <laughs> these next shoes I've also had for a really long time, and they're just my Adidas Superstars. I got these for my birthday, I think maybe three birthdays ago. Yeah, I love these and they're also getting really dirty. Loved these when I got them and I still love them. I just don't wear them as much anymore. Next, I just have these sandals and they're by the brand Blowfish Malibu. These are probably the most worn sandals that I have. I love them. They go with a lot because they're tan and they're simple. They're not too fancy or anything. They go with a lot of my summer pieces that I have. Next I have these sandals and I don't think I've ever worn these. They're so cute. They look really comfortable. Maybe I should give them a chance because they're actually really cute. Next I have these rainbow vans. I just got these for Christmas this past year and I love them. They don't really match a lot though which is kind of sad but whenever I can match it with something I love them and they're so comfortable and they're just so cute. I really, really like them. <laughs> now these next shoes, I don't recall ever wearing. I wore them maybe in middle school. Like I don't really know where I wore these, but I have bright blue Converse. You know, they're actually really cute. Not really my style anymore. I feel like I could make these work with an outfit. I haven't worn these probably since middle school. Honestly, can't even tell you the last time I wore those. These are my babies. I love these. These really cute vans that have tan checkered. They're so cute. I wear these a lot. 
I got these when I went back to school shopping for my sophomore year of high school. I wore them all the time. I love them and I still wear them all the time and I will wear them all the time my junior year. My favorite pair of sneakers. They're like my go-to and they match a lot because they're just black, white, and tan. These are just my black Nikes and I wear these for gym. I wore them for gym my freshman year but my sophomore year I took dance and my junior and senior year I'm also taking dance but we do need to wear sneakers to walk the track and stuff. I do have these for that purpose. You can tell that I wore these on the track because some of the bottoms of my shoes are red. These Nikes are so comfortable. They're really cool, really comfy, really cute, basic. I feel like everyone needs to have like a black tennis shoe in their closet. These flip-flops were not intended for me. Um, they were intended for my brother. They're just black Nike flip-flops. They didn't fit him, and they fit me. I got these flip-flops for my brother for spring break. I didn't end up wearing them, but um, I still think they're really cute and easy to throw on. Everyone has these, so I don't really have to talk about them. Black and white checkered vans. Everyone has these. Yeah, really comfortable, really basic, really cute, go with almost everything. Just a staple for your closet. Uh, yeah, these are just, um, shoes with flowers on them. I actually got these because I had a shirt specifically that would match. Well, I got in these shoes because they match this shirt. This is the only shirt I can really wear these shoes with. Unless I was wearing, like, a white shirt and jeans in these shoes. Honestly, now that I'm thinking about it, it wouldn't be that bad of an outfit. These boots are my everything. These are my Doc Martens. I love these. These are my favorite pair of shoes that I own right now. I got these for my birthday. Um, I just turned 16 and this was one of my presents. They go with everything. They're so cute. They're a little pricey, but they're definitely worth it. Um, I'm not really sure where these black flip-flops are from. Um, I think my friend's mom may have passed them down to me. I honestly have no idea where they're from, but they're in my closet and I have them. I own them now. So They're by the brand Airwolf. And they're actually really cute. I've just have never worn them. Maybe I should start wearing them. Scallop pattern right here. I think they're so cute, but like I never have worn them. I don't know where I got them or who gave them to me or how I got them, but they're cute. So I should start wearing them. Also, everyone has these, but mine are so beat up. These are my black slip-on vans. Everyone has these as well. And if you don't, get yourself a pair because they match absolutely everything. But I might have to get myself a new pair because these ones are trash and they're disgusting. Might have to get myself a new pair of those as well. These sandals I also wear a lot when I'm on vacation. They're just this like olive green with like a brown like strap right here. I really like these. I wore these with a romp, a pink romper I think for my freshman year academic awards night. If I find the picture, I'll insert the picture like right here. I know they don't look that cute. Um, but they're actually really cute on. So these are by the brand Blowfish. I also have this pair of brown boots. These are from Kohl's, I believe. These go with a lot. They're so cute. I love them. I wore these almost every single day to school my freshman year. A sweatshirt, sweatpants, and these. If you go to my school, I'm sorry you had to see me looking like that. They're really dirty now, and but they're really comfy, and they're by Ugg if I didn't mention that. Speaking of Uggs, I also have a pair of Ugg boots that I wore a lot in middle school. They're stained and they're really ugly now. They were so cute when I first got them. I got these for Christmas a couple years ago. They're stained from a birthday party that I went to. I had taken pictures on a railroad track with a lot of my friends for my friend's birthday. I wore these and it had rained the previous night. So they got ruined and stained. So um, don't really wear these anymore, but they're so cute. Um, they have bows on the back and maybe I'll get myself a new pair, a staple in your closet. If you don't have a pair of Ugg boots, I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> these aren't really shoes, but I thought I'd include them in the video. <laughs> if you're a dancer, you know what these are. I don't really know what they're called. I just call them my dance boots. You wear them like before you go on stage and then like keep your feet warm or whatever. You can see that it's by Block. My mom likes to call them space boots. They're so cute and they're, they actually work. Like they're so helpful for our dance competitions or if you're about to perform somewhere and you need your feet to be warm, 
those are the way to go. So if you're a dancer and you're looking for something like that, get those. So if you were interested in getting these dance boots, I'll have the link in the description box. I also have these boots. These are just a pair of tall black boots. This is the brand. These shoes hold such a special place in my heart. I don't think I'll ever get rid of them. These actually still fit me. I've had these since 2015 because these are the shoes I wore when I played piano in Carnegie Hall. That was probably one of the most amazing experiences I've ever experienced. I got to go with a couple of my friends. It was amazing. I can't even describe how amazing it was. These are the shoes that I wore. They have little bows at the end right here. These shoes are all a mess right now, but I have these tan heels that I don't wear often. I can't remember if I got them for a quinceanera or if I got them for homecoming. They're so cute. They're by Lulu's. They're from Lulu's. These really do the job for me because they're tan and they match almost everything. Same with these heels. I only really wear these when I have to go to fancy events. These I got for my 8th grade graduation and I still wear them all the time for obviously fancy events. Little wedges and they're black lace-ups and they're so cute. They also go with everything because they're black. I also have these heels. I got these at Peebles. This is by the brand Sugar. I don't know if you can see that in there. I think they're so cute. And the heel, it's a little tall for me. I think that's everything. I didn't realize how many pairs of shoes I actually owned until this video. After doing this video, I think I'm going to go through all my shoes and get rid of the ones that I don't wear, don't need, don't like, because I definitely don't need this many pairs of shoes. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, and comment down below if you want to see a sweatshirt collection video, because I really wanted to do that. YouTube has been disabling my comments on my videos, and I know I'm not the only person affected by this. If you can't comment on the video, you can follow me on Instagram. I'll have my Instagram right here where you can follow me and comment or DM me or something. Like, YouTube has been disabling my comments. I am now affected by this. I was not at first, but I am now, so that's kind of annoying. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Click that figure out subscribe button down below and click the bell next to it to get notified every time I post a new video. See you guys in my next video.